A crazy day in Connecticut yesterday. We see a much cooler feel for the state of Connecticut. And over in Afghanistan, they are feeling a couple things that we don't normally see. Relatively cool temperatures and even a little bit of rain. That's right, I said some rain. It's not for the desert regions, though, just for the more northern locations. Right now, over in Kabul at 77 degrees, over in Faizabad at 79 degrees, with partly to mostly cloudy skies in this region and actually a little bit of rain that's falling for some places uh, around Faizabad. Herat right now at 86 degrees and down in Kandahar, they're at a warm 91 degrees. So it's a very different feel over in Afghanistan and they will still feel some showers, especially early in the evening for the eastern locations. Calming winds in the west because it's very windy right now. The valley's in the mid 70s overnight tonight, down in the mountains between 8, 58 and 63 degrees for the night tonight. For the day tomorrow in Afghanistan, very windy in the north northwest winds 30 to 35 miles an hour and again a couple of showers for northeastern Afghanistan the valleys tomorrow right around 100 degrees down in the mountains between 89 and 95 degrees for the day tomorrow let's fly ourselves over to South Korea they are dealing with a different type of low pressure system right behind me tropical depression Kanon right now it's spinning with winds at 30 miles an hour gusting to 40 miles an hour so it's very breezy especially in the northern locations right now in Yangyang at 79 degrees down in Busan same thing 79 degrees as well and over in Gunsan at 75 degrees so it's a windy and a very cloudy evening right now in South Korea for the day tomorrow in South Korea there will still be some showers thankfully that tropical depression will track its way north and east but partly cloudy across the state some showers and storms especially for the southern locations temperatures between 84 and 88 degrees in the south and in the north highs topping out right around 80 degrees hey I promised one thing for you that I didn't give you and that was a forecast for the troops for the places that are in the United States I am definitely gonna give that for you tomorrow but if you want a forecast for anywhere that we have troops just let me know in the comments section below and again if you have any pictures of anyone you know that's in the military, please send me an email. My email address is sam.cantro at wtnh.com. As usual, it'll be listed in the, the writing below this. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'm meteorologist Sam Cantro. Have a great day.